Good afternoon, Mike Peterson with the latest from the KMA Newsroom on this Thursday afternoon. Fremont County residents are calling for a moratorium on wind energy projects. Residents went before the Fremont County Board of Supervisors this morning, demanding that the board take action regarding Invenergy Shenandoah Hills project. While no action was taken on the moratorium, the board tabled a request for right-of-way permits to clear trees in county rights-of-way for the wind farm. More coverage on today's Board of Supervisors meeting will be available this afternoon at KMALand.com. Clorinda school officials are making temporary provisions for a vacant retail facility. By a unanimous vote late Wednesday afternoon, the Clorinda School Board approved an agreement with Steinbeck and Sons of Griswold for renting space in a portion of the former Shopco building at 1180 South 16th Street for $1,500 a month. Uh, the agreement comes as board members are exploring the fate of the building, which was acquired three years ago for $400,000 for use as a CTE facility, but that has never panned out. Clarenda City officials have begun the search process for an individual to serve as a city clerk and treasurer. Meeting in regular session last night, the Clarenda City Council approved the job description and authorized city staff to begin the search process of filling the position. And KMA Land weather officials say severe weather in Southern California proves that tornadoes are a danger anytime, anywhere. One person was injured and 11 buildings damaged when an EF-1 twister touched down Wednesday in Montebello, California, an eastern suburb of Los Angeles. Brian Smith is warning coordination meteorologist for the National Weather Service's Valley, Nebraska office. He was our guest on KMA's Morning Line this morning as he talked about Severe Weather Awareness Week in Nebraska and in Iowa coming up next week. KMA on track weather, mostly cloudy today. Highs in the upper 40s tonight, mostly cloudy, low of around 30. Tomorrow, 20% chance of rain in the afternoon, otherwise mostly sunny with lows in the low 50s. More news at 12.05, 1.05, 5.05, and 6.05 this evening and online at kmaland.com. Have a good rest of your Thursday. Mike Peterson, so long, my friend.